out later at my workshop. Oh,
Palestinians! We are all Palestinians!
we Palestinians always get. Today, my body was a TV'd massacre. Today, my body was a TV'd massacre that had to fit into sound bites and word limits. Today, my body was a TV'd massacre that had to fit into sound bites and word limits filled enough with statistics to counter measured response and I perfected my English and I learned my UN resolutions but still he asked me, Ms. Ziada, don't you think everything would be resolved if you would just stop teaching so much hatred to your children? Pause. I look inside of me for strength to be patient but patience is not at the tip of my tongue as the bombs drop over Gaza. Patience has just escaped me. Pause. Smile. We teach life, sir. Rafif, remember to smile. Pause. We teach life, sir. We, Palestinians, teach life after they have occupied the last sky. We teach life after they have built their settlements and apartheid walls. After the last skies, we teach life, sir. But today, my body was a TV massacre made to fit into sound bites and word limits. And just give us a story, a human story. You see, this is not political. We just want to tell people about you and your people. So give us a human story. Don't mention that word apartheid and occupation. This is not political. You have to help me as a journalist to help you tell your story, which is not a political story. Today, my body was a TV massacre. How about you give us a story of a woman in Gaza who needs medication? How about you? Do you have enough bone broken limbs to cover the sun? Hand me over your dead and give me the list of their names in 1,200 word limits. Today, my body was a TV'd massacre made to fit into sound bites and word limits and move those that are desensitized to terrorist blood. But they felt sorry. They felt sorry for the cattle over Gaza. So I give them UN resolutions and statistics and we condemn and we deplore and we reject and these are not two equal sides, occupier and occupied, and a hundred dead, two hundred dead, and a thousand dead. And between that war crime and massacre, I vent out words and smile, not exotic, smile, not terrorist. And I recount, I recount a hundred dead, I wish I could just run barefoot in every refugee camp and hold every child, cover their ears so they wouldn't have to hear the sound of bombing for the rest of their life the way I do. Today, my body was a TV'd massacre and let me just tell you, there is nothing your UN resolutions have ever done about this. And no soundbite, no soundbite I come up with, no matter how good my English gets. No soundbite, no soundbite, no soundbite, no soundbite will bring them back to life. No soundbite will fix this. We teach life, sir. We teach life, sir. We Palestinians wake up every morning to teach the rest of the world life, sir. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, hold on. Traffic threat called her baby girl Janine. And did you hear Amne Muna screaming behind their prison bars as they tear gassed her cell? We are returning to Palestine. I am an Arab woman of color and we come in all shades of anger. But you tell me this womb inside of me will only bring you your next terrorist. Beard wearing, gun waving, towel head, sad nigger. You tell me I send my children out to die, but those are your copters, your F-16s in our sky. And let's talk about this terrorism business for a second. Wasn't it the CIA that killed Alende and Lumumba? And who trained Osama in the first place? My grandparents didn't run around like clowns with white capes and white hoods on their heads lynching black people. <laughs> I am an Arab woman of color and we come in all shades of anger. So who's that brown woman screaming in a demonstration? Sorry, should I not scream? I forgot to be your every orientalist dream. Genie in a bottle, belly dancer, harem girl, soft-spoken Arab woman. Yes, master. No, master. Thank you for the peanut butter sandwich is raining down on us from your F-16s, master. Yes, my liberators are here to kill my children and call them collateral damage. I am an Arab woman of color and we come in all shades of anger. So let me just tell you, this woman inside of me will only bring you your next rebel. She'll have a rock in one hand and a Palestinian flag in the other. I am an Arab woman of color. Beware, beware my anger. We're going to conclude the demonstration now. Unfortunately, we weren't, we weren't able to march into town, which would have been ideal to go down to the BBC building and demonstrate there. But unfortunately, we didn't get permission. What we're going to do is have, a, like I said earlier, a planning meeting this coming Tuesday. There's loads more information if you, if you check out the event page on Facebook. And we've got most of your details, so we'll send out all the information as well. The idea next Saturday will be to, to have another rally and march through town and make it even bigger with a stronger voice. So what you have to do, guys, I want you to all make sure you tell everyone, tweet, Facebook, text, call, bring your family, bring your kids, bring your grandparents, bring everyone. Because as long as this injustice is taking place, we should take it on ourselves to say, we will not stand for it. Now, my dad used to always say to me one of his favorite quotes, and it's a bit of a long one, but to me it's one of the most powerful quotes. And he says, washing one's hands, of the conflict between the powerful and the powerless is to side with the powerful, not to be neutral. So we have to always side with the oppressed, not the oppressor. And remember that every time you're watching your TV screens and you're seeing those children, babies, elderly, women, men, all being massacred, because let's not forget 32 schools and hospitals have been bombed. So this is a massacre, nothing else. Never believe the propaganda and make sure you get that message out. Give to the guys here from the Penny Appeal, and make sure you speak to all your MPs, all the elected representatives, and send complaints to the BBC. We need to get it out, get the message out, loud, clear, and our solidarity is necessary. Thanks, guys.
free! Palestine! Free, free! free. Palestine! No justice! No, no peace. peace! No justice! No 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 peace!